This is not necessarily what I imagined when I thought of mermaids. I think she looks gorgeous. I think I forgot to get... <laughs> I forgot to give her shoes. Hello everyone, my name is Berta and welcome back to my channel. Today we are bringing back some characters from a long, long time ago on my channel. I used to do an island living let's play, but I didn't really continue doing that after a few parts because I wasn't really enjoying making it so I decided to stop doing that series. However, you have probably heard of the new expansion pack Eco Lifestyle coming out in June, I believe. Yeah, in June. And I am very excited for that. So I am gonna give Let's Plays another shot. When I thought of Eco Lifestyle, I also thought of, you know, everything we had in the Island Living pack, you know, conservationism, all that kind of stuff. Did you just... Oh, I don't know why, but my sims keep wanting to pee in the bush instead of going to the toilet, even though the toilet is way closer. So I thought I could use a character from this save file as the main character in my future Eco Lifestyle Let's Play. So, um, yeah, this is not only a follow-up of the Island Living Let's Play, but it's also a preparation for the Eco Lifestyle Let's Play. So, yeah, I'm very excited about that. I don't know which character I'm gonna use in the upcoming Let's Play, but we'll find that out later. You don't have to watch all the other videos uh, to understand this video to know what's going on, but if you want to, I will leave the links to the Island Living Let's Play in the upper right corner and in the description, so you can check it out if you want to, if you want to know more about these characters and what they've been doing. But to keep it short, this is uh, Kaimana Kapule. She uh, lives here, she's a native. And we have Jake, Jake Gordons, and he is not from here actually. He's uh, He went traveling here and he met Kaimana and he fell madly in love. And then he decided he wanted to be a conservationist, so he decided to come live here. And Kaimana was super nice and had him live with her for a while. And then she fell in love with him too. And um, now they live together. They have a way bigger house than that they used to have. Um, they got a dog named Wallace. It is a Scottish terrier and he is super cute. And um, they are actually... Oh, don't follow the dog. <laughs> they actually are engaged. So Jake proposed to Kaimana and she said yes. So they are getting married. I hope to do that in this video. And um, yeah, they also got a kid. Um, so yeah, this. Where is she? So this is Kainoa. It's their daughter. And um, she only just grew up into a child. She's a vegetarian because she's taking after her parents that love nature. And she's like, I don't want to eat animals. Don't want to kill them because she loves them too much. So she's a vegetarian. And she is the type of girl that, you know, prefers to wear more comfortable and practical clothing rather than fancy clothing, but she does have a girly side which comes out, you know, during parties and stuff. People call her Noah instead of Kai Noah because some people have difficulties pronouncing names. And um, yeah, I think she's super cute. And that's <laughs> where we're at, basically. In this part, I was thinking of doing the... of having the wedding. That seemed like a fun idea. I have to change up the bed because this is still a toddler bed yeah so uh we got the right bed for noah at the moment so she can comfortably comfortably sleep kaimana just went to work she is a diving instructor i believe um yeah scuba diving instructor so that's her job um she doesn't work that much because it's only a few hours a day so she does earn a bit of extra money doing paintings and stuff. That was uh, it, basically. So I think it's time to plan the wedding tomorrow at an event. We're gonna have a wedding, yeah. Yes. Okay, guests. Ooh. His parents, her parents and her 
sister. I am missing a sister. That is annoying. Cause now Kaimana has to plan the wedding because I think she knows everyone. Guests. Well, her kid can come too. Look, this sister I was missing. She doesn't know his parents. Okay, well, we'll have him do it. And um, just invite the sister that we can't invite. This way, just on the wedding itself, we'll be fine. Oh, he needs very good friends with him. Let's have a caterer. And let's have a mixologist. I hope we can pay for all this. Um, we don't need a musician. Um, I want to to have the wedding at a venue that I just placed, but I don't know what it's called. Can't we go there? Okay, so I changed up the venue type. It is now a beach. This is the venue and it's working, finally. So at what time do we want the wedding to start? Maybe 3 p.m.? Maybe we can do 4 a.m. No, not 4 a.m. <laughs> oh my gosh, 4 p.m. Thank you. Yeah, that sounds good. We're done. It's planned. So I'm just gonna play through this day and skip and see you all back the next sim day. So it is the next day and as you can see it's almost time for the wedding to start. Jake is still at work and Kaimana is sleeping because she was tired and I didn't want her to be tired at the wedding of course. Uh, why are you napping? Why do sims nap when you can sleep? Don't get it. What the? How did she just do that? You know, I made a cake, but I forgot to put it in her inventory. I know that this venue has a kitchen, so it's not a problem, but it's annoying either way. And we still need to, as I said, invite her sister over. Kaimana can quickly make a cake because we're gonna need that. Why can't I do it? There is no available fridge. Okay. Now... You should be able to make a cake. Thank you. They're all in the wrong... Oh, he's... Where... They are wearing the right outfit, but Kaimana isn't. Wear the right outfit. I think she looks gorgeous. I think I forgot to get... <laughs> I forgot to give her shoes. But um, it's on a beach, so it's not weird. She can just walk barefoot. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Nay. Don't. Is this is supposed to me. No. Why is this wedding a failure already? Just get a new one. A white cake. Thank you. This is so annoying. Finally. Now quickly add wedding toppers. Pro tip, I guess. If you want to have everyone sit down for your wedding ceremony, you just make a group of everyone. And have them sit together and then you do the ceremony. It always works. Okay, so everybody's coming to sit here and now we're gonna get married. This is so cute. Okay, so they're married now. Look at them. They're so cute. I forgot to tell you who made this beautiful venue. So it's a romantic beach wedding by... Majul's 85 and the home that they're now living in is the Sulani Beach Bungalow by Lilane. Let's get the cake and put it on the middle of the table and then don't cook. They should be able to cut the wedding cake. I wanted them to do the... Um, yeah. Oh, they're doing it now! Joking, joking. It's still happening. It's still happening. I love that interaction so much. Okay, so the DJ got here. Isn't she looking fab? I love how Mako is just wearing his diving goggles and snorkeling gear at our wedding. Kaimana's sister still hasn't come over, so I'm now having Noah invite her again. Let's hope she comes this time, because I do want her to be here. I love she's ha how she's dancing with her back to everybody. But sure, if she wants to do that, that's fine. The mixologist is here, so let's have drinks. Let's get everyone some plasma jane. Oh. 
Hey, I'm pressing all the buttons. <laughs> Finally! Okay, her sister's here. I feel like Kaimana's just filling her in about the ceremony and how it all went and what's going on. I mean, these random townies are now dancing on our dance floor. Interesting um, eyebrows she has. And she doesn't seem to be too happy to be working here. Oh, he needs to... Why don't Sims just go to the bathroom if they need to go? Don't embarrass yourself. Please, go to the toilet. What's this? Foul fruit? From eating... Oh, we can't apparently handle... He can't apparently handle plasma fruit. What? Why? Everybody can. Well, they seem to be able to. Kaimana isn't feeling nauseous. Oh, but she hasn't had, hasn't finished her drink yet. Oh, I didn't know they couldn't handle these things. I thought it was just, you know, not with real plasma. <laughs> okay, so we got a gold on the wedding. I'm thinking of ending it because two out of the three sims are feeling miserable. Why are you roller skating? Okay, so Kaimana is now also feeling bad from the drinks. I think I got everybody feeling bad from the drinks. <laughs> we got a gold medal anyway, so the wedding was very nice. And I think it's now time to go home, everyone. Why are you going while wearing your diving suit? Well, if that makes you happy to- Oh, you're going through the water! Why? <laughs> I guess the easiest way to go home is apparently to swim or to go by a boat. You know, it's really cool with the volcano in the background. Okay, so let's just all go to sleep, alright? You two and you two. Let's quickly have Noah do her homework. She's gonna feel terrible. Oh, poor thing is going to school. Stinky. I'm so sorry, girl. I promise I'll do better next time. Okay, so we got a call. Kainoa spent most of recess running around trying to kiss some of the other students. She, she didn't catch anybody, but the other students were running away. So we got the choices too young for kissing and just kids being kids. I think it's just kids being kids. Anyway, Jake also woke up and, um, you know, yesterday when I actually told him to go home, he went beachcombing and found a tulip shell. But he didn't only find a tulip shell, he also found mermetic kelp. And he's like, Kaimana, look what I found today. I found mermetic kelp. So he's like, do you want one? Give gifts. Yeah. So he's gonna give her some mermetic kelp. Does she like it? I think she does. Either way, Jake doesn't know this, but Kaimana has been reading this book, Seduction by the Sea. And she thought mermaids didn't exist, but this book is about mermaids and made her think. So she's done some research and she's thinking, you know, I think mermaids do exist. And you become a mermaid by eating mermetic kelp. And, you know, Jake just gave me one. So, you know, I might as well try, see what happens. So she is just going to eat this while Jake is not looking. She's like, should I do this? Because what if it works and I turn into a mermaid? I'm just going to try. So it says on her buff, as thoughts of coral reefs and salt water fill Kaimana's mind, she has the sudden urge to enter a large body of water. Should she answer the call? She is, because she is a child of the ocean. So she likes to swim anyway. So that's what she's going to do. Oh, that was a nice dive. <gasps> okay, so it did work, but where the heck is her tail and why okay okay girl back up for a second why does she look like this why doesn't she have a tail and does she look like this this is not necessarily what i imagined when i thought of mermaids anyway so yeah the mermetic kelp worked that she's now a mermaid and um she seems pretty happy about it i hope jake is too because he just got married to a human woman and now he's suddenly married to a mermaid so yeah 
I'm going to end this part here. Uh, thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy this uh, video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more videos. I do create a sim video, speed builds, and as I said, I'm going to try and do a let's play in the future as well with the new expansion pack. So if you're interested in any of that, go subscribe to the channel and also click the notification bell if you want to be notified whenever I upload a new video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all next time. Bye! <laughs>